Hi guys, for those who don't know me, my name is Joy. Um, I cheered at Ashland for the past three and a half years, so definitely familiar with at-home workouts in the summers. Um, for those who are really sad about not being able to cheer the rest of the year, I definitely understand. I've been a substitute teacher, so now I currently can't work, so looking for more opportunities, so I definitely know how you're feeling. Just try to stay positive, so I'm just going to share with you some of my favorite at-home workouts to try to help you keep conditioning during this time. So the first one, I'm just using a textbook. You can use any books or anything, or you don't have to either. We're going to do some hip bridges. So you start like this. You can just put the book anywhere and then bridge up. Try to go as high as you can and just hold it about three seconds. You can hold the book down. And I would just do about 10 reps of those. And then after that, I'm going to do some jump squats. So you jump together and then squat apart. And do 10 of those as well. Then after that, I would do some pulsing squats. So spread your feet a little farther and point your feet out. Just pulse. This will work this area right in here too. Um, the next you can do, call them fire hydrants. You'll see why. Just stick a leg out and do 10 each leg. If you have resistance bands, you can also use those for these. Just put a band here, then resist as you go up. Next is jumping lunges. So just start in a lunge and then switch to the other leg. Try to do about 20 of those, so 10 each leg. Next do donkey kicks, 10 each leg. So this is when you just kick back. Next, we'll just repeat them all over again. The bridges. So 10 of those and then if you want you could try doing it one leg too. I'm going to put your leg up or here and bridge with just one leg. Try to do 10 of those each leg. Back to our jump squats. Fire hydrants. You 
get any of these as fast as you can. Try to jump high in between. And donkey kicks. Do these try to make sure your butt comes off the ground and do about 10 of these try not to use your hands then probably my favorite because it lifts your lower abs our sprinter crunch so you'll be laying flat and then bring one knee up and one arm up kind of like you're sprinting and just switch legs And then next, do some penguins. So you want to touch the inside of your heels. Go to one side and then the other. Try to do about 40 of these. And then go ahead and push up into a plank and try to do that for a minute. And then bring your hips down. Show you from the side to go push up in your plank. And then try to do some V ups. And for your jumps, instead of going up into a V, you can actually go out into a straddle. So you'll lay down flat, then bring your feet up, go into a straddle. Try to do 15 of those, and then after that you'll just repeat.